Okay, we continue learning Shmiras Shabbos Kolchasei Holchais Bayer. We finished off Sibchav Beis, which was washing fruits, and we just left off with a statement from Ramaisha. So we're just going to conclude the sugya of washing fruits with Ahara uh, Nundalid and Ahara Nunvav. In Ahara Nundalid, he quotes Ramaisha Feinstein that's Mistabek in Motor Gam Zman. This is on what we'll call it category two, which is pay rates, which are davok with psilas. You have your items that have actual dirt on them. Ramesh is not sure. Maybe you could do it for lacher zman. And the reason is, because this is a safer part, this is mash with motor. Why? It's like washing a, uh, washing a utensil. No one ever said a washing utensil is bayer. So lachaira, he has it sad. You're even allowed to wash off the pay rates for lacher zman. However, not so clear. But at the next level, which one has to just be honest, at the next level, that's really the level that most of our fruits are going to be, which is that they're be'etzim clean. Just you're washing them for epis, you know, a little more yafi, a little more beauty, because your mother and your grandmother told you that if you don't wash it, you know, it's uh, diseased and insecticides and things like that. So in Hara Nunvav, he points out, the the mutter, there's nothing there. It's not ban, it's not noticeable. It's like removing dust and dirt from your garments. No, it's a prayer. Now there's other Yisurim, parenthetically, that, uh, what? I, I mean, you, it depends who you ask. Yeah, some people they'll, they'll. What do you mean? Of course, you. Of course, if you don't, if you don't wash your apple, it's going to be gross. But yes, our fruits are clean, and therefore there is no problem. It happens to be not not to hate on Israeli fruits. You know, Paris arts, but it might have to do with the Makolid guy. It's only the Israeli fruits. It's the Makolid guy that left them sitting inside a, a pile of I don't want to say what. And it could be that you know. Yeah, let's move on. Sev Chav Gimel Ha'ichal Hanavim Mina Ashkol. You're eating grapes. Yishvinayim, there are amongst them coming up in Rukuvim, rotten grapes. So what do you do? It's during the week, what do you do? You take off the rotten grapes, you throw them out, then you eat the rest. Says the Shemir Shabbos, of course, you're not allowed to do that. It'd be an Eser Boyer. So what do you do? Yitlash is the time you pick up the good ones. So Eser, who writes to Lech Lach Shav, they want to eat right now. Below us, Yitlash in Bedai to Lech Lach, which you do not want to eat. Yishar, Velo Yitlash, you leave them and you don't pick them. Now you could realize that there is a bit of a chiddush over here, because one might think, why is that called a Tarev? It's not mixed. They're not touching each other, because the answer is within one cluster, they're all one entity. Was? Luma, let's let's continue for a moment. Luma Zeis, I just want to finish the set. We'll see if he tells us what you just asked. Um, opposing this, Oichel, Oichel Tapuach. No, no, excuse me. What would you ask? To pick them off? No, absolutely not. That's what you just said. If there's rotten ones, if there's rotten ones, if they're rotten ones, so so so. What's your question? Think of grapes. Think of grapes. Yeah. yeah, that's called us, sir. That's called butter. It's called us. It's called beer. Yeah. But it can't be. It, yeah. Oh, good. Go. We need to get there. We need to get there. We need to get there. That's something else. That's serving. That's serving. When you serve, you're allowed to serve. Be, 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 yeah. To Ben Shchai about that, because that's the way that the way to serve a meal is beravchos, because no one puts out two pieces of chicken, and when the third person wants a chicken, I'm sorry, let me go to the kitchen and get another one. You serve more, but you can't kasher it; it doesn't work. You can't pick them up. I'll have a grape now, and now the whole bowl is mutter. No, it's each one is a separate ma'isa, and that would be aser lumazais. On the other hand, this is a big chiddush about to happen. You have an apple, you have a fruit that's a little bit rotten on part of it. So you want to cut off that part. You're allowed to cut off the bad part to eat the rest. Well, why is that? That was odd. Why are you allowed to take off the bad? Why are you allowed to take off the bad? never allowed to take off the bad. Why are you to take off the bad? Oh, says Ha'ara Samach, very good. He says it's like peeling a fruit. Well, we're able to view the Ryan part as if it's the peel, and therefore you're allowed to do it. However, the very big however, if you continue, it seems like Rishon Mizalm is not really so happy with his psak. Shamati for Rishon Mizalm into Mistaver Shesvaras Hamatirim who told me that some is a dogim similar to the bones in the fish to hoyel the derech achila yibekach 
Sharinan like in Sif Yedalid. But if you go back to Sif Yedalid, that wasn't the Lechatchila. The Lechatchila was to take the fish off the bone. Over there he said, are those Ipram? Kamila Hanoya again. There's a Kula. It's a little bit misleading. I don't know what happened over here. Chav Gimel should have said that there are there is a market to be makal. However, v'ulam noisim shamach and hami dasar kan. So I know I wrote on the side of my uh, Shmir Shabbos here, Sibcha of Gimel is a shikl misleading. You learn Sibcha of Gimel, it sounds like that this is an independent heter. It's absolutely not. It's a heter based on the bones, but by the bones, the chatzchil is not to do it. That's where Shalom Zalman thus taught us. And it's not like klipa. To us, I'm yavshu like yilach habli klipa bi. And he continues, achi tochein, but maybe shigam dinin akilah v'ari lafiya nevel el haru lemen dal shirin lekilah the actual tiyach with the chliba over the chlazer the kigav chanam did done sarchi. So Reb Neubert had an interesting svara. The Rebbe seemingly was not fully maskim to it, and yeah, so is a mutter. There is a makim to be made. But let's finish off the sif, and this is the way to do it. We mean a mitzam same. So don't be so precise. And you take a little bit of the fruit, fruit, the like fruit off of it. Mutter gam mina samach lasuda. Then it's always mutter. I what about tashlis? So what's the answer? Why not? Otherwise, we well, could eat it. Just we need shabbat lasuda. So there's two answers. The first answer is he didn't say that you discard it. You just cut that part off, then you hold the rotten part, and you eat the good part from it. No, that's not what he's talking about. That's not what he's talking about. The answer is, if you're throwing something out for a greater purpose, to be mocked like the sheet, uh, that would allow you to violate, at some level, the baltashchis part of it. Siv Chavdal. Shnei Rav and we have two types of food, which are mixed together. We're now morphing into a new form of buyer, which is food with food, which you're about to see as a mayur dikakula coming up. Right now, you have two types of food, which are mixed together. Now, what are your two types of food for the moment? We're just going to call them two types of food. As soon as you're going to tell me two color jelly beans, you can tell me green apples and red apples. As soon as you're going to start telling me uh, dark chicken and white chicken, we're going to get into issues. So two types of food. Mota lakachat esamina sharoitza lachol achshav. You'll have to take that which you want to eat right now. That's called the oichel. Aval aser is forbidden. Aser is a min she'ina writes. You now take off the one you don't want. Lechel achshav mikiv and she'isha love shame psilus because that's called psilus. Look in sif ayin beis ulachain and therefore. Kaira, a plate. Shemurav of a pear is between them shining different types of fruit. Al yasser mimeno is a pear is in a road to be machshav. Don't remove that which you do not want. Kadeshi or reka pear is she writes like also you have the fruit that you want to eat. Aval, however, much less is a pear is she writes like a machshav. Number one, you have apples and oranges. You want the apples, take off the apples. Oi, or light is kola beira is minakaira. This is the other eight that we said. You spill all the fruit out, bimurav, velas saif, and together, as I mean, she writes lach lach shav, and together, that which you want right now. Vra lunsif meme continues, uh, application of this, salat yurako. So the first part of this sif, I'm just letting you know, we, the next sif is going to modify. So hold for one moment where that first part talks about shnei mine oichlen mu'uravim. So for the moment, we're just going to keep it extreme. You have apples and you have kumquats. Two completely no shaykh's entities. Apples and oranges. Or a salad. You have a salad of vegetables that have onions in it. Misha inoy oyhev lechales a batzel. He who does not like Onions, aser la siroi. Why? It's an onion. It's food. It's edible. Half the table is eating it. No, you're not. And and it, don't make it into an onion issue. It's tomatoes. Okay. You don't like tomatoes. Everyone at the table, oh, wow, wow, you have these most fresh, amazing tomatoes. And you're sitting there saying, oh, I hate tomatoes. How can I get rid of the tomatoes? So if you do not want it, you are not allowed to take it out. What do you do? So eat the veggies and leave over the onion. Oi, or a eats that we've learned in the past. Yasir as a batel, you can remove the onion and via achel and feed it to Oisai lechaveroi to your French Oyev lechal Oisai achshav that wants to eat it right now. So that's the eats to give it to someone else. If your wife's a nido, whether the matters up, it's your shirayim or not. Ayin in yesterday's harchak ishir. That is Sif Chaf Dalit. Sif Chaf Hey. We learned Sif Chaf Hey and then we can have a beautiful. Contrast to what's going on. Listen to the heter that's about to happen in Sif Chavei. 
Tatichoi's pieces. We have pieces from one type and one um, min. The same item. What do you mean the same item? Afilu einan shavim begaidlam. They're not the same size. A tiv is a nature and a min is a type. Yeah, you, you'll, you'll see. It's, it's, he's using fancy Hebrew. He's going to explain in a moment. You're going to see in a moment. He's using fancy Hebrew for a moment. Feel inun shavim begaidlam. They're not the same size. Did I say that right? Motor livra mi binayam. You're allowed to be buyer from between them. Gamas elash in bedait lachol miyad. You're allowed to take the one that you don't want right now. Why let it take the one you don't want? Didn't we just say the one that you don't want becomes the psalis, becomes the refuse? Vitam adover. She'enoi boyer kan min elchon mi min acher. You didn't take one type from another. Elakulon min echod heim. It's all one min. Vehein oimdois lachilon. They're all able to be in. Rol alon. Lefekoch. Here it is. Hayu lefanam nitchei basar kitanim ugedalim. Nitchei is a cut. Nitzchei is how you do a surgery. Nituach. Nitzchei basar ketanim ugedailim. You have pieces of meat, small and large. You cut up the roast, and it's all sitting there on the cutting board, and you have the nice big fat pieces, and you have the smaller littler pieces. V'kula mimin achad. Umevushalim ba'ifin achid. And they're all cooked the same way. Listen to how precise he's being with his words. Then, mutter lahaitzi afilu as ilu she'inu roitz lech lech shav. You allowed to say, "Oh, that piece of meat that doesn't it didn't cut so nicely." I'm, I pick out the one I don't want. Vuadin like I've a chetichas dagim fish mi min achadim ayvin achnasin ushave kigain. They're all prepared the same way. Kun shikulim bevushalais. They're all cooked and kulim mitu ganais. They're all fried. Gamim bechelik men mitu yois yoiser adaroit. Even if one of them happens to have more bones, v'chein adin legabi peirais mi min achad umma zan echad v'kulin teriim. They're all fruit. They're all fresh. Motu a liver afilu oisim shirts and lishma lizman mucher yoiser. You let it pick out the ones you want to save for later. Gam yich davkas like gedolim oyes like. You have a whole basket of apples, but some are fresher, some are better, but they're all apples. You let it take the, you let it eat, either A, remove that which is quote unquote you don't want, or you let it B, remove what you do want, even for lachers, man. Because this is how there's no buyer error if it's all one min. And the million dollar question is how far do we go with min? Echad. If you saw his examples, he's being very precise. So now what we do is, we go to Ha'ara Samach Beis. And Ha'ara Samach Beis, he quotes the Mishtabura, and the Mishtabura says that if you have apples, tapuchem metukim v'chamutzim, sweet and sour apples, the primagodim is mistapek, the primagodim is unsure, is in doubt. Whether that is called min echad. Ubedagim and fish mevushalom metuganim, Vadai chashivi kishnei minim ayin sham. Now that's the line that we have in the Mishnah and everything else is to figure out where does everything else in the world fit in. He continues and he gives us a little bit of guidance. He says just to, to skim down a little bit. If you go down about eight lines, the first one line is ayin sham. Says ayin seif sim shini yates bi megadim. The kosher chalukim b'taimam. If it has a different taste, ay b'shmam or a different name. That is called two different items. Okay, that's one way of, of figuring it out. The next line he says, It's all chicken. But you have the liver, and you have the neck, and you have the chicken. That's also shnei minim. End of halacha. The question is how far this goes. The question is how far this goes. And, and here breaks out really mamish world wars like you've never like you've never seen this is where um the famous stories with you eat the bones from the challenge comes from this is where chicken skin comes from la marshall you have a piece of chicken and you want to take up the skin so if you're eating it right now there's no question because it's called a klipa you remove the skin and you eat it let's say you don't want to eat it right now you want to prepare whatever dish you bring you want to remove the skin is the skin a separate mint or is the skin part of the chicken? Well, it's the same name and it's the same everything. And do people eat it? 
So you ask 20 different people, 100 different Jews, you get 100 different answers. Between I only eat the skin, I'll never eat the skin. The skin's the best part. The skin's the worst part. If there's skin, I'm not buying it. So what's the skin? So L'chaira, based on what I just said, we could all agree, or maybe we should agree, that the skin is certainly a part of the chicken. You might, you might not want it. The question is, how far does this go? Fat on meat. There's the level of fat on meat that half the world eats. So let's say you personally don't want it. It's not that you're, a, be careful. It's not that you're allergic. It's not that you hate it. You just don't want it. Can you cut it off? Yeah, why not? It's a minachad. It's all part of the same item. You have a large kakish cake. Yeah? And we all know the end pieces, unfortunately. Lo yotzlachs. One second. They just didn't make, the, the chocolate didn't make it in. So when you serve the cake, what do you want to do? You want to cut off the two ends, and then you want to serve the middle. But you're doing this for Friday night for Shabbos day. How's that not by her? You're taking off the bad part. The answer is that no one's going to say it's not chocolate cake. Kagish cake is part of the kugel. You want to cut the inside and serve the inside and leave the ends for yourself to eat later, obviously. But other people think it doesn't look so nice. Is anyone going to say that? Of course, that's a minach, of course, it's the same item. So we didn't really quantify 100% in every case. Most cases are machlaikas, kedarka bakaydesh. But in certain cases, you could understand that, that this is this is normal. And min echad, min echad. And that's the reason why, just working backwards in Chavtalid, when we said removing one food from another food, you just have to be very careful. You know, all, all jelly beans, well, they all taste the same. Well, then someone else, no, they don't all taste the same. And this one says, what do you mean? The reds are the best. If they all taste the same, how can the reds be the best? Well, then, okay, obviously there's a difference. That they look different. So that by itself will make it a different min. That's min echad.